and I joined the St. Lawrence Figure Skating Club in 1965. Um, I was from Potsdam. My sister Susan and I, I think, were the only two kids from Potsdam at that time. Um, when I was seven years old, my parents had taken us up to Montreal to spend a weekend up there, just a family getaway. And while we were up there, my dad looked up in a newspaper to find something to do, and he noticed that they were hosting the North American uh, Figure Skating Championship. So we found the rink and bought tickets. We didn't have to wait in line. And as soon as we got in our seats, there was a power outage. So for two hours, we sat in the dark, waiting for the championship to begin. And when it did, and the competition was over, a woman from the United States won, and it was Peggy Fleming. And at that time, my sister and I decided we wanted to become figure skaters too. So my parents found out that Canton had a figure skating club. Um, my mother told me that my first pair of skates were CCMs, cost $6 about how much you pay for a pair of laces nowadays. <laughs> when we joined the figure skating club, Sally Shantz was the coach. She was the only coach. At that time, there weren't as many members as we have now, and one coach did it all. We had group lessons on Sunday nights and Thursday nights, and it was a big group lesson. Everybody was in the same lesson at the same time. Uh, Sunday morning we came and a few kids took private lessons at that time. When Sally Shantz got married and moved away, then Irma Starro took over. And she later married and she became Irma McGee. And she also was the only coach for several years until a student from St. Lawrence University joined the staff and that was Bob Crowley. And a lot of you probably remember Bob Crowley. I'm sure at some point during uh, this short segment here that I'm speaking, you will find a picture of my sister Susan and I uh, and as we were a duet in the ice show, we were country cousins. Fortunately, many changes have occurred since then. There's been better hairstyles and nicer dresses. An increase in membership and coaching staff had occurred to allow the St. Lawrence Figure Skating Club to evolve into the competitive club that it is today. And afford a carriage, but you look sweet upon the seat of a bicycle built for two. My name is Alicia.